Hello everyone, this is Vizvedo and today I'll be bringing you a new, awesome, promising free-to-play horror game called Sega Takai. Uh, this is made by using the Unreal Develop Development Kit uh, by, uh, I don't know the people who made this game, I really don't, I should have uh, made some they should have made some research before this video, but nope, I did not. Well, everyone makes some mistakes once in a while. So, yeah, this is a Slenderman game, but this is much better than a regular, reg regular Slenderman games. In regular Slenderman games, yes, you collect eight pages, but they made this more complicated and more challenging and fun than the others. You have to collect keys to unlock doors uh, and they are scattered all around this place. This isn't only a one house, it is much more than a house. Uh, there's like, you have, you can go outside in the forest looking for them and inside a house and here's a catch you cannot plan this game how do you play it in the future because this game every time you uh, start a new game you start in a new place you don't always start in the same place you start from a new uh, place to make it more challenging which is a great idea I like the idea a lot and the graphics are really great in this game for a free-to-play game I mean look at them they are so pretty and really well done made I gotta say that makers of this game has put a lot of effort to this game they just didn't do this by <laughs> just like that they really did some working with this game they uh, they just they how do I say it? I'm so confused <laughs> with the words. Uh, let's see. Let's think. They they worked hard for this game. That was the word. And they made this game really scra scary, creepy. Whoa. Where did that came from? And the atmosphere in this game is so freaking scary. As you can already tell it from the video, I mean, whoo! And it is not easy to find those pages. They are, they can't be literally, they literally can be everywhere. I mean, anywhere. So it isn't so easy to find them. And what makes it even more interesting, if you don't start finding those pages, the Slenderman's aggro is growing by the time. First page, in the woods. Okay, now our next stop will be in the woods. Oh, <gasps> mannequins, I don't trust them. Yeah. Oh shit, my lantern is going out. I better recharge it for a while. This, this is so scary. I can't tell if he comes or not. But this house, seriously, this house reminds me of the grudge. If any of you have watched the Grudge movie, this is kind of like the same. So scary atmosphere, dark, and scares you from time to time. Oh fuck! And this is seriously frightening. Scary as fuck. Oh my god, I wanna get out of this house. It is... This... It, this house is like a little labyr labyrinth. You can't... It is not easy to get out of here. I mean, seriously, it is not easy. It's kind of hard to find your way out of here. Run, 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 run. Oh, fuck. We are here. God damn it. Well, let's look around. Whoa. So, what could have made this game the most scariest game ever if there was a lady in black hair 
like the Gratz lady or even dolls. I'm so really scared of those things. They are so freaking scary. If they would have put them in this game, I wouldn't have played this game at all. <laughs> but I would rate this game 10 out of 10. This is perfect game, really well made. This game gives you a challenge, which is a great idea. Great. You can challenge yourself and also friends in this game. There's a challenge thing in the end of the fuck. In the end of the game when you die or you finish the game and you got multiple endings in this game. Oh, there's another page. Multiple endings which makes it even more interesting and you wanna play that again. But I wouldn't play this game again. This is so freaking scary. I don't like that at all. Where is this cylinder guy? <gasps> oh shit! He was right there. Son of a bitch. They added the jump scare sound in this game. Holy shit, it got me so freaking hell. <laughs> okay. Yeah, definitely a 10 out of 10 game. Uh, graphics are great. Playability is great. I. Yeah, in here you can see the challenges, total time, pages found, ending, difficulty, keys, uh, time before you got the first page. This tells you literally everything what you did in the game. And yeah, that is a great idea, that challenge. So great job with this game, guys, whoever made this game, really great job. I really enjoy this game and I will see in the future if I will play this game again so this was just my first try first attempt uh, stay tuned for more attempts I will try to beat this game some way but until then uh, this video thanks you for your time and hope you enjoyed this video stay tuned for more exciting videos bye bye